Okay, I'm gonna show you some quick tips on how to tune your djembe. These are for rope tuned djembes. The first thing you gotta look is at each strand you're counting as one. So you're gonna make a weaving pattern. This is one, this is two. You're gonna take your cord and you're gonna go under two, under this one, under this one, and then you're gonna pull it across. What we're gonna do is weave these two so that we can tighten them by flipping them, and this brings the ring down and tightens your drum. You just wanna tighten your drum until you like it. Don't over tighten, because you can pop the skin, and you don't have to tighten to a specific pitch. So I take the strand, if it's too hard for your fingers, you can get like a screwdriver or something. I just kind of push it under. Here's under one. I go to the second one, under two. I pull through. Sometimes I put my foot on the drum, it's okay. Here's under two. Now you'll see the cord is under two strands. One, two. We're not quite done. We go under two, over one, under one. So we weave back. Under two, over one, under one. Like this. Try to keep the cord straight. And you'll see now that as I start to pull this, I'm pulling those two pieces of rope closer together. Sometimes if the drum is tight, you want to use something like a stick or a mountain climbing cleat to grab the rope if it's really hard to pull. It depends on where you are in tuning the drum. I like to take a stick, I put it over the rope, I go around, and then I turn it and I do figure eights. This will lock the stick in place, you see? Then, using my feet, I'm gonna pull until it flips over, you see? And this is gonna tighten your drum. Now, just to make sure it stays, I start the next sequence. I go under the rope, just like that. I pull it through, keep it low, and this will help lock it, see? The tension here is holding this rope so it doesn't unsnap. And then you wanna check the skin and make sure you're not over tightening. But these are some tips on how to tune your djembe.